Shalom, Shalom, Yahshua Allah. We're going to start off first things first, giving all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Rakadash. Which in the Pele Hubitan, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Double honor to the Apostle, Elders of Great Millstone. And Shalom to your sisters and brothers that's laboring in this truth. And Shalom to your brothers and sisters that's listening and studying to show yourselves approved. Shalom. A mighty works is happening right now, Yasharala, which is Paleo Hebrew for Israel. And this word is really starting to accomplish everything that Yahweh Bashmi Yahushua has set it out to do. And we know that by seeing the prophecies come to pass. And so with that being said, it dawns on me that something very big and crucial, Yasharala. And you know, it really just hits you, it shows you that. All this work the sister brothers are putting in and putting out, we're starting to see the fruits of that labor, man. Yahweh Shah hears us. And that right there is so profound and big, man, to be heard of the Lord of Lord, King of Kings. He hears us. And our kingdom has been prepared. So all that does is motivate you more to do this work and continue and keeping the lost commandments of your how about you to the best of your abilities man it really motivates you man and it shows the power of the word of your how about you so let's get to it man which it shows us right here when i go to let's start out we're gonna start out with john one and one because it's been since the beginning this word has stood the test of time that's why all these false religions don't hold no weight when it comes to this word that this Lord has preserved for us. So this is John 1 and 1. In the beginning was the word, and the word was with Yahweh, and the word was Yahweh. So let's talk about the Son and the Most at the same time. It has let you know that Yahweh Shah was heard with Yahweh when he made the world. This world that we live on. And they not, there ain't no holy trinity like Prince Christianity try to say because Yahweh Shah sits on the right hand of Yahweh. They're on the same accord. That's why I said the word was Yahweh. Yahweh Shah, the son, the Messiah, he was the first spirit made. He helped Yahweh make this world we live in. And that power hears us. He's hearing us. He's preparing that kingdom for us. He's taking Esau, Edom, a.k.a. the white man, down. Right before our eyes and setting us up in order. And that is power right there. And he did it through his word, by speaking. His word is thousands of years old. And it's going to the major play right now. Prophecy is unfolding. And it's unfolding at such a magnificent rate that a scoffer can barely, he can't even say nothing against it. Akim, brothers, we getting ready to come into glory. It's starting to be seen on us. I can see it in, in my family's eyes. The stuff that you say, they can't say it no more. Why? Because prophecy is raining out. This word is being fulfilled. And it's shutting them up. The devil is scrambling. And it's a beautiful sight. And check it out. We're going to go to Psalms 19 and 4. Their line is going out through all the earth. And the words to the end of the world. And them have he set a tabernacle for the sun. Hey, that's, a, that's the, the house of David. That's here. Yahweh Shah is coming back to claim that. That's why the Lord calls it a marriage. These men that's doing the work are about to receive those crowns from Yahweh Shah. All the men you see doing this work, singing this song. That's a line, man. That's like a line of help. A line of communication. That's that word, man. We putting it out, we sending prayers up, we hollering, we begging the Lord, we calling out to the Lord. 
Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. And the Lord is hollering back, I hear you. I hear you. Continue, endure. I got you. And that right, man, we, we getting built up, Akim. This word is sharpening us up, it's refining us, it's polishing us. We're getting ready for rulership. The whole world done heard this word through the power of the internet. That's how the line went out through the whole earth, man. You call the World Wide Web. This gospel is dominating everything right now. Hot topic, Hebrew Israelites. What we gonna do about them? There's nothing they can do. Yeah, how about your child will get that precious fruit that he's had set aside since the beginning. And everything is becoming clear. Prophecy is raining now. And what did Yahweh Shah say about his people? Let's go to John 10 and 27. He said, my sheep hear my voice and I know them and they follow me. You peep that? He said, and I know them. That's the best thing you can ever ask for. It's for the power that made the sun, moon, and the stars to know you and to love you. That's huge. He said, my sheep hear my voice. So you can't call yourself a hopeful elect if you're following any other religion other than this word, man. This word is what makes you a sheep of your how about you was shy. And following these commandments. Because when you follow these commandments, you're doing what? You're following Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shah. Doing the high holy days, rehearsing the righteous acts, because that's what we're doing. Lord knows we can't keep the law perfect. We're rehearsing the righteous acts. It's a guideline for us to live by. That's where Yahweh Shah said that blood. So we'll still get in. We know it's laws we can't keep, laws that we're breaking. But we don't let our sins weigh us down. We continue in the faith. Because Yahweh Shah said, I got you. I got you. I hear you. And that right there is strengthening. They're strengthening us, Akim. That right there is strengthening us. And just know that the Lord hears us. Those prayers are getting heard. And I'm loving it. Let's get something else. Check it out. Since we're talking about hearing the word, the Lord hears us and we hear him through this word that he gave to us. This is Luke 6 and 47. Whomsoever cometh to me and heareth my sayings and doeth them, I will show you to whom he is like. Woo, who is he like? We're going to break it down next in it. 6 Luke 6 and 48. He is like a man which built a house and dig deep and laid the foundation on a rock. And when the flood arose and the stream beat vehemently upon the house and could not shake it, for it was founded upon a rock. And what rock is that? Yahweh Shah. That's that rock. All the sisters and brothers in this truth, we done, we done laid everything on the line for Yahweh Shah. Everything on the line. We putting everything on Yahweh Shah to deliver us. And the Lord said, hey, I liken you to a wise man that built your house upon a rock. Anything else is sand. And so we putting it all for Yahweh Shah and we're doing this, hopefully that he hears us. Because we hear him. We believe in him. Now we want him to hear us. And now we're looking to be accepted by Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. That's what we're looking for. And we just had to let prophecy play out. Only way we're going to know that is, you know, when you get beamed up in that chariot and you get that crown and you see Yahweh Shah. So that means we got to endure. We got to continue. We can't stop. Ain't no stopping. We have to continue.
So check this out, man. That's why we call upon the name of the Lord. This is Psalms 105 and 1. Oh, give thanks unto the Lord. Call upon his name. Make known his deeds among the people. That goes into the works. That's why we go out on the highway and hedges. That's why we do this video of pistols. We're trying to show other people who Yahweh Bashmi Yahweh is. So we're hurling his coming. Because best believe he is coming. So we're telling him repent. For the kingdom is at hand. And then we go into the scriptures to show you the deeds of the Lord. How he saved Lot. How he saved Noah. We about to get that same type of salvation. Lord, one of the part of the hope we lack. He said, give thanks unto the Lord, man. We pray and we call upon his name every single day. It's Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah all day, every day on everything. You know, people in the world even get jealous, man. You don't hang out like you used to. You white people get jealous. I don't get the time I used to, man. They, they, the world try to suck us back in to go back to what we used to. Because now we all about Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah. And we're calling out to him like a father. And we're looking for deliverance, man. We're giving thanks unto Yahweh for sending us the one begotten son, Yahweh Shai, who we're going to get the victory through. Who's going to put crowns upon our heads. We glory in that. Like the Lord said, you glory, if anything, glory in the fact that you know me. Because the whole word is about Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. That's what the word is. And let's prove that. This Hebrews 10 and 7. This said, Lo, said I, Lo, I come in the volume of the book. It is written of me to do thy will, O Yahweh. So Yahweh Shah did the will of Yahweh. And if we're looking to get the deliverance of Yahweh Shah, we got to do the will of Yahweh. And what did the Most High say? What did Yahweh tell us to do? Keep the commandments. And Yahweh Shah said, I'm about to sacrifice myself for those men. They are beloved. They are precious. And it's a fight. Yo, I wish I don't want no weak punks, man. He calling for those men. We in this world fighting for righteousness. Declaring it. Telling you how wish I was about to come. Then he hears us, Akim. Yahweh wish I hears us. So let's continue to do this. Let's continue to fight. Let's continue to call upon the name. Let's continue to do this work. And Lord willing, part of the whole food lack and we get the fruits of our labor. I just want to put this quick lesson out to let, you know, encouragement, let you know. Our you sister brothers, man, Yahweh Shah is hearing us. He hears us. This is not going in vain. It won't be in vain. This is how we get the victory, Akin. And I know you can see it like I said. We almost up out of here, man. Lord, hey, you strapped him up on this wicked kingdom. So with that being said, man, I hope it's been edifying. I hope it's been very encouraging. I want to say Kwam Yashra Allah. Hey, stay locked on this truth because Yahweh Shah is quickly on the way. Shalom.